Hi, this is Natalie Lucier, and today we're getting techie with your passwords. On your mark, ready, set, let's go. Dance, go, pro. I know, you know, I go psycho when my new joint hit. Just can't sit, gotta get jiggy with it. That's it, now, honey, honey, come ride. TKNY, all up in my eyes. One of the things that I've been noticing lately is how likely it is for people to get hacked. So not all hackers are as hot as Angelina Jolie was in the Hackers movie. We all have the ability to protect ourselves from hackers. And the way to do that is to use a very strong password. And you know, password protection, we probably all heard recommended lengths and use numbers and letters and different characters and all that good stuff. But the problem becomes that we then have way too many passwords to keep track of. And if you're gonna use the same password everywhere, that's another vulnerability that hackers could use against you. So this is why I'm introducing you to this really cool application. It's called 1Password. And how it works is that you only need to remember one password and this application saves all the passwords that you use all over the web. For you. So it'll save your Facebook, your Twitter, your websites, your bank account, anything that you want that you want to be really secure. By. Okay, now let me show you how to use 1Password to keep the not so hot hackers out of your account. It's very secure, so if you go away or you know if somebody takes your laptop or something, it's not like they can just use all your passwords. You do need to enter that 1Password. So here I'm going to enter my 1Password and then it will show you all of my logins. You know, as you can tell, I have like hundreds if not thousands of logins here. And it's really, really useful to have everything in one place so that if you're on a new device, you know, on your iPhone or your iPad or whatever, you have access to this because there's apps and there's other ways to access all of your passwords. And what I really want to stress here is that having an app like this is really going to improve the quality of your passwords, the strength of your passwords, and also just make your websites, your email, everything that you use on the web so much safer because you'll be able to use more complex passwords and you know vary them from site to site so you're not always just using the same password because I know how dangerous that can be if somebody you know, hacks into one of your accounts, they then have access to all your other accounts if you use the same password. But this time, you know, using 1Password, you don't have this problem. I'm gonna say uh, log in to my Facebook here. So right now, as you can see, I'm not logged in. And if I click here on this little button, um, it will allow me to just click through. It'll enter my details and log me in automatically, which is really cool. Now, let's say that I wanted to sign up for uh, a new account somewhere. Um, you can actually use 1Password to generate a password for you. So as you can see, it creates random um, characters and uh, you can basically select how long you want your password to be. It'll make it more uh, strong. And as you can see, it'll indicate how strong your password is. You can also include symbols, which will help as well, and um, enter that in. So when you do sign up for an account here, and you click on I accept and everything, uh, 1Password will actually save this password, save you the username or the email address or whatever you're using as your login. And then the next time you come back, you just click on this login and then click right here and it will log you in automatically. I don't go anywhere without uh, being able to use 1Password. If I was gonna buy a device or a new laptop or something, I would make sure that 1Password was available for it. So, that's my recommendation for this week, and I really, really encourage you to check out 1Password. I mix it high, getting jiggy with them. Getting jiggy with it. Getting jiggy with it.